The Chimps on the Wall here, and today we've got a interesting situation. It's neither a saving disaster campaign nor a saving disaster battle. This guy has basically challenged me to defeat the Nakai uh, quest battle. So, I haven't actually done the Nakai quest battle. I, I did do a Nakai campaign. I didn't really enjoy it that much. I had a really tough time at the start. Uh, but I never bothered with quest battles too much, usually because... It, unless the item is essential, I just don't bother with it. Um, it's just not worth my time. Uh, you know, in the campaign. So, based on this, it seems like the the Nakai quest battle is the same one as Gorok, except that, you know, you play as Gorok when you're playing as Gorok. And I witnessed Major Kill in our co-op campaign try the, the Gorok uh, quest battle and get beaten. Not because he lost the battle, but because one of the other lords got wiped out. And when that happens, you lose the battle. So the guy's basically saying, can you win this battle? Now, the odds might seem it's not too bad, but the problem isn't our army. It's one of these guys. These guys here are suicidal. So I thought, okay, look, this guy's already got it set up for me. It's pretty early in the campaign. He does not have a very good army. So I'll give it a shot. And we'll see how we go. We'll see if, if what people have been saying about this quest battle, because a lot of people have been saying that it's too difficult. And I've just never attempted it because it felt like it's not worth it. It's like there's... Like, the item just isn't worth bothering for. Especially if the quest battle is difficult. I'm like, why bother? Risk-reward. High risk, low reward. Why bother? Like, unless it's providing global public order bonuses, which for Nakai he doesn't need. Um, it's like, I don't care. Alright, so I've, I've seen this battle once before, so I know what happens. So I need to make a rush over to Gorok and the other dude to to stop them from dying. I don't want to see this. I just want to, I just want to get straight into the fight. All right. I want to send the salamander hunting packs to go and help them because I feel like they could do the most. Now, unfortunately, I'm not familiar with his army, so I don't know what to expect. Um, I think what we should do here is uh, not try to defend our position. Alright, this is a bit of a mess. Let's just go down here. Closer to our allies. That way, in a pinch situation, we'll be able to do something about it. Yeah, just, uh, just ignore them. Maybe, maybe leave this guy behind. Maybe. Yeah, you definitely shouldn't be doing this this quest battle this early. Cause this is another thing as well. Just just I gotta pause because I'll let Oh it's not on legendary difficulty. Right. Um what what battle difficulty is it though? Uh, it's only on hard difficulty. Alright, well whatever. Here's the thing that I keep telling people. Sometimes creative assemblies set you up to lose. They set up a situation and they it looks like, oh, I gotta attack because the enemy is right in front of me. But in essence, the best option is to just not do what's expected because the AI is like, oh, y you didn't do what I wanted you to do. And they just completely do pet, uh, derp out. So that's what we do in this situation here. What if we just ignore that first army and uh, help our allies out? Because everyone's like, it's so hard. My allies keep dying. Well, why don't you go help them at the start? Fuck this army here. There's no victory point here. What are we defending? Bunch of patch of green grass. Fuck it. Let it go. Let them have it. Fucking vampires. Eat my shit. <laughs> ah, he's so uncouth. Yeah, I know. They're just gonna sit there anyway. This one here looks like it's in the, the most trouble. So yeah, you, you gotta get, you gotta keep that guy alive. Oh, they're just sitting there. Cool. All right, there's a, who's that? Okay, whatever. Gorok's kind of got the same idea. We just got to be careful not to, like, cause too much damage to our units. These guys here can do a lot of friendly fire. Uh, yeah, I don't, 
I just gotta wait for my reinforcements to show up. Just, we're gonna be coming in in a bit of a bit of a. It's, it's just not gonna be ideal, but let's see how we go. It's interesting to see that Gorok pulled himself out. What the fuck is he doing? It's not my unit. <laughs> The Harkon's closing in with his main force. Whatever. Eat my shit. There's no victory point on this battle. So. So just ignore him. Oh, right, no, no, no. He's coming in from over. I see, I see. It's fine. Bounce of power slipped away from us, but. So, so yeah. Um, your army's definitely not ideal for this at all. Uh, like I said, you're doing this way too early, but, uh, I don't know, I don't, I don't think it's hopeless. Just like, this would be pretty easy if you just had, like, all Stegadons, instead of Stegadons down here, just fuck them up. No worries. But yeah, if Luther Harkon's coming down this way, gotta protect this slan over here. Just, I'm coming in, like like all over the place on this because we just, we just got to get the shit done. Yeah, you come around over here, wizard. I got to get back into some semblance of a formation, but we're tidying things up over here. Yeah, there's Luther Harkon there. Okay, maybe, maybe you come over here. If I could get some magic down that... Ooh. Yeah, you, I don't think you're supposed to be doing this on turn 55. Oh, what are you doing? It's like, they're so suicidal. It's a shame you can't advise them and be like, Hey, hey bro, uh, maybe not do that? Yeah? Careful, We're, we don't want to do too much friendly fire. <sighs> I can run over here. This is where the, I think this is where the main fight's going to be. I really don't like the Gorok's over there, but Gorok is a really good fighter, so we'll make do. What abilities do you have? Oh, who cares? I'm not kind of shit. Alright, Skaven have been pretty much defeated. Um, we'll, we'll just let our allies handle the rest of that. And at the end of the day, we've got to keep our allies' generals alive, more than anything. You know what? I really kind of wish he was on a Pterodon. We haven't been able to use up any of our magic yet, because I just I haven't been able to get into range. Maybe I should have kept him there at the start. Alright, here, here comes a lot of troops. Nakai, you need to get in there. All of you guys need to get in here. Might kill some of our owners, but there's more of them than there are of us. Plus, you, you gotta protect the, the fucking suicidal slands. Is that Luther Harkon? Might take him out. Where are you? How'd that one go? Not great. Uh, a lot of... What, what are these? Okay, we'll just wait and I'll, I'll cast another one soon. Yeah. 
All right, where, uh, okay, yeah, you, uh, no, 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 you're, you're fine there for now. What about these other two? Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay, we ready to cast again? All right. We got, we got lots of large out here, and they got lots of infantry, so even if we hit our own units, this will do more damage to them than us. Yeah, that was way better. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Fuck, look the Harkon. If he doesn't want to come into melee, there's not much we could... Actually, you know, there is something we could do with it. Shoot him. Good Goroks over here. We're all fighting together. That's what we need to do. Those who fight together... Live together. I was gonna say they die together, but no, 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 we're not gonna die. Burn that stupid vampire, Nehekar, and motherfucker. Is this a Hakon Nehekarin? Yes, he is. Most of the vampire accounts are actually. Like Vlad is. I don't know about Manfred actually. Be careful not to. Is there? Oh, there, there, Slans. There, he's damaged. That's not good. I need to get more dudes over there. Protect the fucking Slan. Just get him out of there. God, this battle is such a shit show. I don't have any reserves anywhere else, do I? Where are you? Okay, get him out of there. Ah, oh, shit. Still need more Winds of Magic. How much do we need? 11. One more. Okay, so that'll come in in just like a second. Yeah, let him get out of there. Such a shit show, this battle. Uh, do I, I don't have any fast units. It would be good to get rid of those mortars, but I don't have any fast units to go do that. Plus, they're not- they don't have that much ammo left. Someone get rid of fucking Luther Harkon, please, before- Before this guy commits suicide. I'm sure Gorok is still fine. He's in there, He's he's got loads of health. Bounce of power is great, we just need to win now. Come on, you fucking slad, get out of there. No, no, you get... Just get in there, get in there. Like, they've, they've got the army loss penalty. We won. Okay. Well. Now, I know it wasn't a very hard difficulty, but our army's still in pretty good shape. Uh, and on, on different difficulty settings, I mean, no matter what happens, your AI, AI fights on normal difficulty. They don't have the normal buffs. Oh, sorry, they have no buffs. So, I'd say, given what we did there, if I was to do it again, but on very hard difficulty, I'd say we manage. That technique worked really well. Um, what would have helped us more on this battle would have been more Salamander hunting packs. Fewer of these guys here, they didn't help at all. The magic was great, but if you can put him on a, an, on a um, Pterodon, that would have actually been really helpful, because we just weren't using magic at the start. But at the same time, we managed to use it really well in that particular situation there, so that worked out very nicely. So, pure victory is always going to be the case, but there you go, you got the quest battle. This is really early, I reckon, to do that. Um, this is the first time I've actually done that quest battle before, so I've never lost this quest battle, because I don't usually do it. Um, definitely not an army that I would have uh, recruited myself, it's definitely lacking a lot of cheese, but uh, yeah. 
if you're in this situation and you're going to do the um, the quest battle, I would highly advise don't do what's expected of you. Do what's not expected of you. Don't engage the first army. You you just don't need to fight that army right there. It's just going to tie you down. Forget about them. Go straight down. Help out Gorok or the fat ass or the slan. Go and help them out and just ignore that other army. Because once you've helped them, you fight together, it's just better. It's better if you prevent one, present one united front against them. Worked quite easily there, I think. Um, I mean, we cut it pretty close with this dude here, but Gorok was fine. I wasn't worried about Gorok. Anyway, that's the end of this one, guys. I hope you found this battle helpful in doing your own quest battles with with either Nakai or with Gorok, because this battle is the same um, for them, except if you play as Gorok, obviously you'll be at the bottom of the hill in his starting position. So if you play as Gorok, get up on the hill and save Nakai, because Nakai likes to kill himself. Um, but yeah, if you play as Nakai, go down the hill, save the slam, because Gorok can handle his own. Anyway, that's the end of this one. Hope it helps. See you next time, fuckers.